Stand here at Lake George, the largest freshwater lake in Australia. At uh, 25 kilometres long and 10 kilometres wide, that's quite a lot of water. The surface waters uh, disappear through the subterranean aquifers, and some theorise that these disappear in as far away as Peru or even New Zealand. Um, others claim that apparently the surface is in yes, but um, it's hard to know until we do more research. Sure, she's out here. She's got to be. I know she is. She is out here. Going. It's funny if I can get a veggie samosa, I think. Have you seen a mother like this? No, I haven't. I must find her. He hasn't got on the face, but he's got it right wrapped around his neck to his ear. It's a tribal thing. Yeah, it's a tribal thing. Uh, they call it they call it mocha, which is like the bones. Mm. They can tell like where someone comes from. 
from their bone, from their tattoo, which is about their bones and where they're buried, where their yeah. relatives are buried. Right? That's a big thing for them. Have you seen anyone out in the lake? Yeah. I heard there's someone missing. <laughs> what do you think you're going to find on the lake? I tell you what you're going to find. You're going to find bones. Bones of those army cadets who drowned back in 56. They're just scattered out there, baking in the hot sun. But you know what? When the sun go down and the stars come out, the eyes open. Yeah, the bones got eyes. Not on the ends like a hammerhead shark, but all along. And when the stars come out and they look down into the bones, the eyes of the bones, they look deep, deep, deep down into the eyes of the bones. <laughs> <laughs> it's all about the bones. <laughs> hey, what do you think? Come on, brother. Come on, brother. Give it to me. The bones have eyes. The bones have eyes. Uh.